All right, so today we're going to go over this pretty fun little worksheet here called Why Did the Cow Want a Divorce? So basically we've got these graphs here, and then whenever the line um, hits one of these letters there, then we cross out the letter on the bottom here, and it's supposed to solve that question of why did the cow uh, want to divorce. So let's, let's start with number one here. Y equals negative two. That's pretty easy. We've got our X axis is that horizontal axis. Y axis is the vertical axis. This is zero and zero, dead center right there. So Y equals negative two. We are going to put that right dab in the center right there. And that's just going to be Y equals negative two at that spot, negative two. And we've got an F that we're going to be crossing out. So let's go ahead and cross out the F there. All right, let's go on to the second question. X equals four, zero, zero there. Let's count one, two, three, four. X equals four, straight line right down there, right through the P. Let's cross out that P. All right, let's go on to question number three. We've got an equation here now. So we need to get Y on one side, uh, opposite of the, basically opposite of everything else. So first thing we're gonna do is subtract two X, two X there. So that's gone. And then we're going to divide everything by minus 3. Let's divide that whole thing by minus 3. And that's going to give us y equals minus 3 plus 2 over 3x. All right. So that means that we're going to start with y at negative 3 will be here with a 2 over 3 slope. So that's up 2 over 3. Up 2 over 3. And that's your line right there. That's going to go right through G. So let's go down and cancel out G. It's G right there. All right, let's go on to question number 4. So let's add 4 to this side and subtract X on that side. So we're going to have y equals, well that's actually going to be 2y equals, we've got positive 4 minus x. Now let's divide both sides by 2, divide by 2, and we're going to end up with y equals 2 minus 1 over 2x. And so y at number 2 is going to be there with a negative 1 over 2 slope. So negative 1 over 2 slope is going to be down this way, that way, that way. And that's going to go right through letter L. So let's go ahead and cross out letter L there. All right. So let's go on to question number 5. So question number 5. Uh, we're going to subtract 3x from both sides and divide by 4. Let's divide by 4, divide by 4, and we are going to have y equals 3 minus 3 over 4x. So y is going to start out at 3, 2, 3, with a negative 3 over 4 uh, slope. So down 3 over 4. Let me tie that down like that. Perfect. All right, and that's going to go straight through letter C. So let's go ahead and cross out C, and I think that's the only C there. All right, next question, number 6. All right, so let's subtract 20 from this side and then subtract 6x. So we're going to have a negative 20 minus 6x, and that's going to equal negative 5y. Let's divide everything by negative 5. We're going to end up with y equals 20 divided, negative 20 divided by uh, negative 5 is equal to 4. And that's going to equal a positive 6 over 5. Oop, 6 over 5x. So let's go up positive 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 
and then we've got a slope of 6 over 5 there. So we're probably just going to go down 6 here. 1, 3, 4, 5, 6 over 1, 2, 4, 5. Wow, that only gives two, two lines there, two dots there. All right, so that's going to go straight here and straight through number or letter W there. So let's go and cross out W here and W there. All right, and all right, yeah, we're right at the end here. So X there, easy, subtract negative three. So X is gonna equal negative three. And that's just gonna send us straight through N. And there as well. All right, number eight. 2x equals 7, because we're going to add 7 on over to that side. Now let's divide everything by 2 here. Divide by 2. We go x equals 7 over 2, and that equals 3 and 1 half. So it would be 1, 2, 3 and a half. Goes kind of straight there. Uh, okay, that line's going to, whoops, that line, that line's going straight through here lines coming straight through there right through the center not going off to the side there or anything and that's gonna cross out letter I let's see I I okay and our last one here let's go ahead and add 2x over to that side and subtract 2y over to this side so we're gonna have negative 2y equals 5 plus 2x x. We're going to divide everything by negative 2. Negative 2. And that's going to give us y equals negative 5 over 2. 5 over 2 minus x. So negative 5 over 2, that's going to be 2 and a half. Negative 2 and a half. So of two and a half is going to be right there. Ooh, they got us in halves here. And then slope's going to be at a negative one slope, so at least that's somewhat doable here. All right, negative slope there, negative slope there, negative slope there. Okay. That goes straight through O. Straight through O. And we can solve our answer here. And the answer is, looks like the answer is going to be, let's see here. She had a, oh, that L is actually crossed out there because we got the L there, bum steer. So that's the answer. She had a bum steer.